I need somewhere I can have total isolation and above all, atmosphere. What lives in this house? No one would want to live in Balpatermana. What stalks these halls? It's a cursed place. Yes, I saw the movie. What hides in these shadows? And who is playing that piano? <coughs> Welcome to the house of the long shadows, home of mystery. <coughs> Suspense. Danger. And now the four masters of horror are moving in, Vincent Price. We came here this evening to unlock the final door to our destiny. Christopher Lee. It would seem, Mr. McGee, that we are imprisoned here. Peter Cushing. It is all I have ever known. Fear. John Carradine. Death is our only true destiny. Joined by Desi Arnaz. You ain't seen nothing yet. House of the Long Shadows. You could. Lose your life. Worse. Will this talented young man wager his very life for one night with this girl and these strange bedfellows? House of the Long Shadows. There's one missing. What is its diabolical secret? And suddenly, out he jumped. He didn't even look human. Which key unlocks the horrible truth? I'm afraid it has begun. <laughs> And who spiked the punch? House of the Long Shadows. It's delightfully puzzling. It would appear that you are creating a mystery where there is none. And a frightfully good time. He must have heard us singing. House of the Long Shadows. The murderously funny mystery with a twist. Yes, I see what you mean. House of the Long Shadows. Vincent Price, that's me. Christopher Lee, Peter Cushing, John Carradine, and Desi Arnaz. In a Golan Globus production of a Pete Walker film. <coughs> House of the Long Shadows. From Canon Releasing.
brings you the air support. Kind of like the idea of it. No guns, no kicking in doors, and, you know, just quiet. Oh, yeah. For Frank Murphy, policing the air has its ups. Welcome to air support. And downs. You got a runaway. Just wanted to say, sir, that that was my fault. I talked Murphy into taking us there. You're supposed to be stupid, son. Don't abuse the privilege. Roy Scheider is Frank Murphy, a lone wolf. Freeze! Bozo, how many regulars come in the front door with a key? Who's about to become a guinea pig. I thought it was illegal to arm police helicopters. Well, that would depend on the circumstances, wouldn't it? Columbia Pictures presents Blue Thunder. Flying arsenal that hears through walls, sees in the dark, and thinks your thoughts. Wherever you look, the guns follow. It was designed for war-torn countries. There's one civilian dead for every ten terrorists. That's an acceptable ratio. Unless you're one of the civilians. It was assigned to American cities. You talking about ground control from the air? That's what this special detail is all about. They told Murphy to test it. They didn't tell him what it was for. Doesn't of these coppers and you can run the whole damn country. Who was behind it? Where are we? Federal building. Really? Hey, you want to find out what's going on in there? I certainly do. Wait, you gotta do me a favor. I want you to pick up a package for me. Why they chose him. Uh, he's totally unsuitable for our purpose. Don't stop for anything or anybody. Or why they changed their minds. Turn the face of a good old butt. I never saw this guy before in my life. Come on, let's go. Well, not so fast. That's government's property. Give me that. But when Murphy went looking for answers. You got all this on tape? I got every word of it. If it gets back to me, I'll deny it. The answer uh -oh, uh -oh. came looking for him. They had the ultimate weapon and the perfect plan. But Murphy stole their thunder. Four acclaimed directors, George Miller, John Landis, Joe Dante, and Steven Spielberg, take you to another dimension. being represented by the district attorney. Norman was not convicted of murder. He was found not guilty by reason of insanity. Don't you realize they're going to release a homicidal well, maniac? You sit down, Mrs. Loomis. It's all too obvious. Our courts protect the criminals, not their victims. Norman Bates is just...
judged, restored to sanity, and is ordered released forthwith. It's 22 years later, and Norman Bates is coming home. I own a motel not too far from here, and you'd be welcome to spend the night in one of the empty rooms if you'd like. Good night, Mary. And he's back in business. Who is this? My mother is dead. I'm telling you, there was a note on that wheel from my dead mother. Norman, it couldn't be your mother. It had to be someone else. I trust her. She would never do anything to hurt me. No. She'll kill you. I know she will. No, I... I won't do that. You can't make me... kill her. 22 years later, Norman Bates is home. Psycho 2. It's starting again. The Taste of India. Experience the taste of India. The Regency Tandoori Restaurant. Private functions catered for. Takeaway service available. Are you a bank account kind of person? If you want to open a bank account, you've got to look smart. Smart! Right! You've got to have short hair. to open the account and a reference, and we'll send you a checkbook in a few days. Is that it? Yes. Right. Bye. Hello. Come about a bank account. No chance, right? Well, certainly, sir. Sign this. Don't believe everything you've heard about opening a bank account. At Nat West, it's a dog. the mulcher to some of the best places to eat in the world. He ate the Taj Mahal. Yeah. The leaning tower of Pisa. Yeah. The Empire State Building. Mm. But none of these delicious buildings could match the five chewy flavors of Jewett's. Mm. Yes, ladies and gentlemen, Jewett's mm. are even chewier than Barrow in Furness Bus Depot. Mm. 
When you buy a travel card to get to work, it opens up a lot of possibilities. Because you can use it on the tube and on the bus. You can use it to go shopping at lunchtime, to go out in the evening, or even to go visiting at weekends. Best of all, though, even if you only use your travel card for work, you can still save money. The travel card. It's just the ticket for getting around London. Oh, oh, access. Hide me. What's up, money? Oh, bill's after me. What for? Payment. There's old garage bill, old furniture bill, old department store bill. They all arrived at once. All right, money. Just relax. Oh. I'll take care of them. Oh. OK, money, they've gone. You can come out now. Thanks, access. I'll settle with you at the end of the month. Oh, I can't help you this time, money. Oh. This one's definitely down to you. How is that? <laughs> of a job. Access. Your flexible friend. Visions is a brand new album, a magical journey through your musical mind's eye, the superb chariots of fire, the haunting music from Harry's Game, Arthur, Taxi, Mash, and the theme from the film everyone's talking about, E.T. Just some of the beautiful themes on Visions. In promotion time, our sales staff are now ready to serve you with a choice of delicious Lions Made ice creams, including King Cones. And to quench that thirst, you'd adore Kiora. Refreshing apple juice drink and Ribena, all ready to drink in a carton. Crusader Nuts, a selection of nuts and raisins, cashews, salted and dry roasted peanuts. From popcorn country, super crunchy, super delicious butter kiss. Why not treat yourself to a big value cup of Pepsi Cola, all refreshing Sun Crush Orange. A spicy pork and beef sausage in a sesame seed roll. Frankie's, the super hot dog. A carton of playtime popcorn. The real American style popcorn that's fun to eat. Also a wide selection of confectionery and cigarettes. All on sale now. Right, it's Andrea, isn't it? What's this I hear about Pepsi not being your favourite cola? Is that right? Yeah. Do a Pepsi challenge then. Right. Try them two and then tell me what you think, which tastes the best to you. That one. Does it? Lift it up and see what it is. Take the Pepsi challenge. Let your taste decide. Well, what's that? <laughs> Pepsi. Enjoy, sweetheart, enjoy. Orangey for crows? It's just for 
1980, Miami. They called it Little Havana, where the American dream had a price tag. And only one man in a million was hungry enough to pay. His name exploded through the streets, and his smile seduced a city. His eyes ignited passion, and his hands built an empire. Scarface. Those who loved him feared him. Those who feared him respected him. Al Pacino is Scarface. He loved the American dream with a vengeance.